What is up, YouTube? It is your boy Texas Chris coming back again with another video. And as you see by the title, today we'll be doing another reaction video. I would also like to say, if you're not subscribed, make sure you go ahead and subscribe right now and enjoy the video. And just enjoy the vibes, you know, because for all the previous videos that y'all showing love on, thank you. I'm going to stop yapping and let's get it right into the video. Hope y'all are having a wonderful day. Oh, my, bro, my bad. Today we'll be writing to Stolen Legos, Leads the Bomb, Found During Travis. I can't read. On January 24th, 2022, a Walmart employee notified officers of a woman that had stolen Legos worth nearly $300 in Broken Arrow, Oklahoma. What are you doing? An officer happened to spot the woman's Legos. vehicle and conducted a traffic stop. The woman was identified as 20 year old Mariah Davis. Recording. Nah, the traffic stop is crazy. I said it's a traffic stop. Hey, I'm Officer Johnson. At the red light, is crazy. Hey, do you get your license and insurance on you? So the reason we stopped you is today because Walmart called and they're, did you suspect of possibly ringing up some items? Mark. Huh? You said they have ringing items? Yeah. Mark. Yeah. Huh? You bought items? Why is he trying to hide his face? Okay. Like, hide his camera. Alright. So you remember Native American tribe? Okay, just hang tight for me, alright? No, I'm still driving a Crown Vic in 2022 as the police department is Hello. crazy. Is there anyone else in the car? No. Okay. So, what were you doing at Walmart? Shopping. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Because we're going to call it you stole Legos earlier. Imagine. Did he get your ID? You ever been arrested before? Yeah. For what? Receiving um, stolen property because I was driving someone else's car. Okay. What all did you buy? Okay. Bought a dog road on there. Were you at Walmart earlier? She seems kind of sad. She's not making no eye contact. Yeah, oh, there she did. Yeah, no, you shut up. What are you looking for? I, I just like with it for one month. So you feel like you did you buy anything earlier? No. Where were you headed to after you just left Walmart? To get food. To get food? Yeah. Oh, okay. Where at? Were you going to get on the turnpike? Or did you just stop here? No, I just stopped here. I didn't know where to stop. Oh, okay. We can turn around. You have a receipt for the stuff you bought? During the traffic stop, the officer noticed the Lego sets in the back seat, along with what appeared to be an explosive device. Oh, can you roll down your back window for me? Nah, they gotta call a bomb squad and all that. What is all that? Right, Come back here and stand by the back side of the car. No, I'm Is that a freaking Tesla? Is a bullet? Oh, that's OD, bro. That's crazy. I've never seen that. Do you have anything illegal in the car? There's um, a bat. There were these bars in my purse. 
some Xanax bars. You're not prescribed. Oh, okay. she's you tweaking, have any guns bro. in the car? Any other drugs? <laughs> okay. No. Bro. Yeah, go ahead and secure her. I explain to me what that device is in the back of your car that looks like a bomb. Uh, I didn't, my boyfriend made that. Okay, sit tight. Whoa! There's a fucking bomb in the back of that car. Like, a bunch of fireworks strapped together with, like, Bro. metal and shit and wrapped around. Okay. Can you start a supervisor I didn't make the my boyfriend like did. Sort of explosive device in the back of the car. That I got Vimex as well. And I stole it's from got, Walmart. Like, four... Nah, she tweaking it. She started and tweaking. Like, big ol' screws and shit all within that. And then it's wrapped, got like a bunch of stuff wrapped around But like, it. how do you know it's not like a lot of blow up right now? go off. How big is it? It's sketchy. It's like this big. Don't they have to shut down like a whole road? That's a big it's deal, bro. Right? made to cause some damage. So, like, matter of fact, a like, huge freaking deal. Oh, God, yeah. If she would have somehow like Yeah, we'll keep them. Somebody else gets here. Yeah. Oh, they're all on mark. Yeah, yeah, yeah four fifty like on mark as well. Just the Tesla. It looks like TNT, and then it's got oh, big like. old metal like uh, screws and like nuts and bolts, and then it's got a bunch of stuff wrapped around it. What'd she say it was? She said so her boyfriend it built it. <laughs> and then there's a bunch of fireworks next to it. All right. I'll keep this light blocked. All right. Kind of, she was quiet, but I couldn't, I couldn't see in the back window because the tent's so dark, yeah. and I said, roll it down, and then I was like, what the fuck is that? Hey, man, at least back he's on it. She just, all she said is that uh, her all boyfriend right. made Can it. Can I see, man? I want to see. Um, so we probably want to figure out who boyfriend is, and, uh. there's any more in his house, maybe. Alright, I'm going to read something to you real quick, okay? You have the right to remain silent. Anything you say can or will be used against you in a court of law. You have the right to talk to a lawyer and have them present with you while you're being questioned. If you cannot afford to hire a lawyer, one will be appointed to represent you before any questioning if you wish one. If you decide to make a statement, you may stop at any time. Well, it's like Do you understand each of these rights that I've explained to you? Okay, are you willing to talk to us? Okay. So what what's the deal in the back of your car? You said your boyfriend built it? I honestly have no I don't know about fireworks except for fireworks. I don't know about fireworks. What's your boyfriend's name? Zane. Zane? Yeah. That is a deadly weapon. Okay. When did he make that? Or like uh a couple days ago. Okay, do you know why he made it or anything? She called her boyfriend, who arrived on foot, and then asked if he could take possession of the vehicle if Mariah was going to be detained. Her boyfriend was identified as 20-year-old Zane Bennett. We met Bro. you with a dog owner who's looking for love. No bones about it. Head to bowchickabowwow.com to find... Bro, is 20? She was stealing stuff from Walmart and yeah. took off and got stopped right there. She's about top on the turnpike, it looked like. What's up, bud? Bro just spawned out of nowhere. What's your name? Zane Okay, Zane, come over here and hang out for a second. Do you have any ID on you? Uh, my girlfriend had it on her. Okay. Uh, I, mean, I have a picture of my ID. Zane? Yes. Uh, I have a picture of my ID. No, let's go back to your Where'd you come from? Uh, I just came around came car wash. My friend caught me up here. Where'd your friend go? Uh, he still parked at the car wash. 
Put your vehicle. Hey, so you're oh. not under arrest, bud, but I'm going to detain you real quick because we got some things we got to talk about. Okay. Which vehicle? Uh, the truck over there, like. The dark Dodge with no front bumper? You want to mess with it, but the truck that just dropped him off is that dark Dodge. I don't know. We want to have somebody go make contact with them. It's his friend. Zane admitted to building the explosive device in a hotel room, using fireworks, and leaving in his vehicle his girlfriend was driving. Okay. So, man, I'll, I'll just, I'll just cut to the chase, and I'll tell you why we have like all this shut down and everything. Is, is it, it has to do with the little device you've made. It looks like some fireworks tied together, some nolts and buds to it. And so so that's why we have this all shut down because it's kind of our protocol is, is it, it looks right. like an explosive device. Right. Whole, you know, it's a, so Fair enough. Do you, is it like active? Is it like volatile no, to where if it falls, breaks, no, is it going to go it, off? It, it's, it's literally just fireworks. Like, like if you take it apart, it's a whole bunch of little fireworks. Like, that are tied like in tape? Well, I mean like, like, okay, so it's like a stick. Yeah. So, so it looked, so it Zane claimed he was going to blow up watermelons and did not intend to hurt anyone. So yeah, he he said he's just out doing, he was going to do some redneck stuff today and he was going to take it out and blow up some watermelons with it. He said it's a couple of fireworks tied together. You have to light it like a normal firework. And he said, I just wanted to see what the stuff I taped to it on the outside would do if I lit it by I mean, it, watermelon. it don't seem like he had bad intentions. Yeah, I said, I said, were you trying to use it as a weapon? Were you going to, you know, go do anything today? He goes, no, I was just going to blow up some watermelons. And I said, okay. And he goes, that's why I left it in the car, because we were going to go, and then we didn't go. So I was like, all right, cool. So he doesn't even seem really ner nervous at all about it. How's it going, bud? All right, how's it going? Good, how are you? Can you stop the truck for me? Yeah. Hey, man, how do you know that guy, Zane? Oh, I just met, he asked me for a ride, said he needed to come get his car. From where? From up at the Canterbury. Okay, you never met him before? Yeah, I'm Eddie. You just know I'm through the Canterbury? Yes, sir. You know I'm through the Canterbury? Yes, sir. You stay up there? No, I don't stay there. Okay, Old you were just over there and he needed a ride? Yes, sir. Okay, do you have ID on you? Oh, man. All right, just sit tight for a second. We'll, we'll get you out of here in a second, but we're trying to figure out what's going on with his car. So much could go wrong. There's some weird stuff in there, so we got to figure that out. We just If you're good to go, you can get out of here. But since you dropped him off and he's directly related to all this, we just want to figure out who you are and if there's anything going on. Oh, okay. No, for me. He's good. All right, you're good to go. No, that's a crazy police vehicle, bro. At 7.30 p.m., the Tulsa Police Department's bomb squad rendered the explosive device safe. After police took an x-ray of the device, it showed Zane used fireworks, fish hooks, metal screws, and rivets. Bro, what? I could just take those with me and bring them back to Walmart later. I know you're not supposed to look up how to make a, like, you know, but, like, I wonder, like, how he learned to make it, you know what I mean? Like, where do you find the time? Yeah, or, with you. or even, okay. I don't know. Zane was ultimately charged with illegally manufacturing an explosive device, and Mariah was charged with petty larceny. Do you enjoy our content Bro, and want to see more? I'm sorry. Can somebody please let me know what petty larceny is? <laughs> I I genuinely don't know, and I want to hear it from like somebody that's watching the video. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. I hope Zane and Shorty get better. Whatever they did i don't know why they decided to make i don't know but anyway if you enjoyed the video don't really like come subscribe don't you subscribe you can get all post notifications text chris Le you know what leave a comment let me know what you think text chris we sign out peace